So, hello everybody! <laughs> um, today I saw something very interesting in the sky, you know, something weird, but that's okay. <laughs> um, well, my hair, okay, I'm doing actually good now. I'm um, using this here, the gauze in the bag, in the bag, in my ear, on my ear. Hmm? It's because um, there's still some stuff oozing out. But interestingly, I, um, I hardly had any itches today. So uh, I guess this um, this um, against um, against fleas and um, this other stuff um, it worked somehow you know actually I never saw any fleas on myself and maybe I saw even some eggs you know but then there are some other eggs all over the place you know this is crazy but um, the stuff I was using today. You put it on and uh, massage it into it and then leave it 10 minutes and then you brush it off with a special comb to see if there's something in it. There was The only thing that was in it was um, before I put the, the liquid on it, I combed my hair and there was a lot of uh, Morgellons in it. Red and black ones and white ones and some green ears. And uh, and afterwards, after the liquid um, was done, like instead of ten minutes waiting, I waited like um, half an hour, thirty-five minutes. Then I was pulling it up through, and I saw well a lot of moisture because this stuff has some something like natural temp turpentine, something like um, similar to um, uh, tea tree oil, you know. And the tea tree oil, when you get it on the, on a wound. Then it burns, you know, and it said on that, you know, you're not supposed to put it on uh, on wounds or something, you know, if, if you have open scars. So I still to put it on because huh, I am so desperate, you know, I just want to get rid of this shit, you know. So um, it didn't burn at all, you know. It has this this some kind of nat I don't know if it's natural, but it is. It has some something similar to turpentine inside of it on it in it and uh, some um, some oil oily stuff you know uh, it's not oil it's some kind of I don't know what natural stuff you may do it yourself by I've seen on a YouTube um, you use um, two tablespoons um, apple cider no apple cider no apple vinegar or vinegar which is you know strong and also to that um, some kind of oil you know because there's the vinegar and the oil, you know, dilutes it and it goes into their breathing apparatus, you know, like the bug, you know, the, the flea has a lot of uh, like a gills and so on, so it suffocates, you know. And it also the, it suffocates the eggs, so I said no more remedies, no more of homemade remedies, you know, like this is a lot of, it's more dangerous using those remedies than, you know, doing good. But it's, you know, it's uh, my opinion, you know. So what do you say to that, Morgellons, huh? Nothing? Say something? Okay, good. And the antibiotica, I did take some antibiotica today as well. But, uh, you know, somehow I felt a little bit uh, that it's not going to do anything today, like uh, itches. But still I did this because I just want to stop this. I even wrote a hospital to, um, to do an emergency surgery, you know, on me. Because this is, this is a nightmare, you know. And if they would take off all this... This garbage that's inside of here, you know, I probably look like a, I don't know, super Borg. So um, since then, I'm I'm feeling fine. Um, I didn't have any itches. Great, except that uh, it's oozing out a little bit here on the side still, you know, and uh, that's all. And yeah, and now I'm going to say that in German, or I'm gonna make a new one in German. Okay, take care for now, and we'll talk again. Bye for now.